Imagine having such power that you become invisible once a predator comes near you. One of the incredible facts about these animals is how they use camouflage to hide from predators or potential prey. One of them is the absolutely incredible barren caterpillar. The common barren caterpillar is the king of camouflage. Do you see him? No? Well, here it is. These amazing insects are often found on a mango tree leaf, and to see it, you'll have to be an eagle-eyed person as they're nearly impossible to spot. This is a great example of the previously mentioned camouflage used to hide from predators. Interestingly enough, not all of them are capable of hiding so well, as some are much better than others. These insects are native to India and Southeast Asia, so what are they doing on mango leaves? Well, the caterpillar lays its eggs on the back of the leaves. As the caterpillar grows, the larvae form a yellow line across its back and pine extensions that look like a needle. Now, let's get into details regarding this creepy yet somehow beautiful sea animal, spookfish. The name says it all. This fish looks like it escaped from Finding Nemo. I mean, just look at it. The most amazing thing is that their eyes are actually those green balls you're seeing placed on top of their head rather than the front things that actually look like eyes. The fish reaches a maximum size of 6 inches and lives at depths of around 2,500 feet. But why are its eyes pointed upwards? Well, if you thought this couldn't become creepier, you were wrong. Its eyes look upwards to spot prey. The big question, however, is how does this fish eat? With its eyes pointed upward and its mouth pointed forward, this fish can rotate its eyes under that dome of transparent tissue. Isn't Mother Nature wonderful? Unlike the spookfish, European eels change their coloring several times during their lives. It's truly unbelievable how they start their lives being transparent and then boom, they turn brownish yellow on their sides and belly. It depends, but most of these animals change their coloring five years after they're born. But the most amazing thing about them is that their eyes grow larger when they get involved in sexual activities. Their flanks become silver and their bellies turn white. You ever heard of a scorpion fish? Not only is this animal one of the best in the camouflage game, but you should also avoid it if you ever do spot it. This beautiful but dangerous scorpion fish is one of the most venomous fish in the world. There are 100 to 200 species of the scorpion fish, and they can be found all over the world, but mostly in smashing that like button. I mean, in the Indian and Pacific Oceans. So how'd they get their name? Well, their name comes from the harmful stinging spines on their body. The spines are covered in venomous slime, and they protect them from potential predators. Their camouflage, however, is the thing that keeps them safe most of the time, since these animals live in shallow waters, they're a threat to scuba divers and snorkelers. An invisible animal that'll be a great addition to your home aquarium is the ghost shrimp. As expected, the ghost shrimp will need lots of attention and affection, but once you see it, you'll definitely fall in love with it. These beautiful creatures will give that love back as they work to keep your tank clean. And it's likely that you won't notice them at all since they're almost completely transparent. There is, however, some bad news. Ghost shrimp have a very short lifespan. They live for about a year. They have an incredible body with a characteristic yellow or orange colored spot, which is set in the center of their tail. That's not the case with the glass frog. There are more than 100 different species of this invisible frog that are mostly found in South and Central America. There are so many amazing facts about the glass frog, that we don't know where to begin. First, male glass frogs stand guard over their eggs. Shout out to these caring fathers, Obviously, the name comes from the appearance of their bottoms. The skin on their bellies is fully transparent, which means you can actually see all of their organs. This is a bit creepy because you can see the frog's heart beating and its organs digesting the food that they've just consumed. The purpose of their transparent skin is to keep predators away. The transparent skin makes it hard for the birds to see these beautiful creatures. One of our favorite animals in this video is the glass wing butterfly. Most butterflies have unique patterns on their wings, making them special. But some, like the glass wing butterfly, have transparent wings, and they're, without a doubt, the most beautiful creatures we've ever seen. Just look at it. They go fully incognito in a second. Also known as Greta Otto, these creatures use their transparent wings to stay away from birds and other predators. In Spain, the glass wing butterfly is called espejitos, which means tiny mirrors. While their wings are fragile, the butterfly can, believe it or not, carry weight up to 40 times its own weight. 
The crab spider is another hard to spot animal that gets its name because it holds its front legs like a tiny crab would. It may be hard to believe, but there are 2,000 species of Thomsidae crab spider, and they can be found worldwide. They spend their lives just sitting casually on a flower, hiding and waiting for prey to come to them, then they attack. Just like a chameleon, they sometimes change their coloring to match the flower they're waiting on, but that's not the most surprising thing about them. These creatures can also match the prey. Yes, you heard that right. They can turn into the color of a bird they're preparing to eat, and some can even imitate tree bark. Known as the crocodile icefish, this is yet another creature that proves Mother Nature is incredible. Crocodile icefish have a transparent body because their bodies lack red blood cells and hemoglobin, and that's why they're sometimes referred to as white-blooded fish. Unlike the previous cases, there are only 16 species of crocodile icefish in the world, and most of them are found in the southern ocean around Antarctica. Here's an optical illusion for you. Can you spot the two pygmy seahorses hiding in the sea fan? No? There they are. Pygmy seahorses are special seahorses that are completely different from any other group of animals. They live in the oceans of Southeast Asia and off the coast of South Africa. Most are no more than 0.98 inches in length. It's believed that there are only eight species. But then again, their small size and their disguise abilities make them hard to spot. The sea salp is a harmless little salp that appeared just a few years ago. These tiny creatures move through the water by pumping water through their invisible bodies. The life cycle of a sea salp is divided into two parts. They first exist as individuals, and then they become a part of a larger organism. In the first phase, they're about 4 inches long, but when they go into the second phase, they manage to create chains up to 15 feet long. Have you guys ever seen an arctic fox? Well, the chances that you'll see this animal are very slim. Can you spot it in the snow? There it is. This is without a doubt the cutest animal on our list, and although you wouldn't expect to find it in the Arctic, they live in this absurdly harsh environment. The Arctic fox has stunning snow-white fur, rounded ears, and prying eyes. But don't let its looks fool you. They're actually quite dangerous animals that'll likely attack you because of the environment they grew up in. Another thing you should know about these cuties is that they have some of the warmest fur of any animal in the world. In winter, their fur grows to keep them warm in the severe cold temperatures. Their purely white fur makes these beauties impossible to spot in the snow. A total opposite is the long-eared owl. This might be an expected animal because most owls are known due to their camouflage abilities, but trust me, this one's quite special. The long-eared owl comes in various shades, including brown, black, gray, and buff, depending on the wood colors they live around. These owls can practically turn into a tree. Found in North America, Eurasia, Europe, and Asia, this bird uses its camouflage ability to catch prey, and the prey can neither hear nor see the owl. The long-eared owl might be similar to the great horned owl because it has ear tufts, but it's actually quite different because it's smaller and slimmer. This, however, doesn't mean we're talking about a small bird. It can be 12 to 16 inches long and have a wingspan of about 3 feet. YouTube thinks you should watch this video next.